Hey, what's going on, guys? Uh, just a quick video. I ain't trying to be too long, but basically, I've been seeing a lot of videos from YouTube or Instagram from like people in the trucking business that's like doing like a semis or like hot shot and everything, just talking down on like people's in the box truck business because we don't make as much and everything. Like that's fine, but you know, at the end of the day, we all had one goal, and that's to work for ourselves is to be bosses you know okay they you know you probably was in the box truck business and that didn't work for you or y'all just became new you know uh the box truck business you know even st started to become popular last year and y'all see it's like a, a a fast money type thing a side hustle and anything and y'all just like oh uh you know i'm just gonna buy a semi truck and you know, uh, hey, listen, however you got in this industry, that's fine. You know, like I wanted to do, I, I wanted to do it the, the, the ground way from the bottom type thing. But at the end of the day, whatever folks your boat or how you got to this industry, I'm fine. At the end of the day, I like seeing my people that look like me get money, but stop talking down on people who's in the box truck industry because, you know, we may not make as much we, we, we don't make as much money as y'all. Like, that's fine. Like, at the end of the day, I came into this industry for two things. To be happy and to uh, be free. Because I no longer wanted to be in the uh, work a nine to five. And I didn't want to be listening to people who don't care about me. And, you know, learning from that, I, can, I learned that, you know, people are human. And people got, uh, you know, like a, a life after the job. You know, uh, hopefully I learned from that from my from from my uh, experience. And when it's time to, when it's time for me to hire other workers, I I know how to treat, you know, my workers and stuff like that. You know, like right now, like I said, I'm going to be driving my own trucks, my box trucks. And, you know, just so I can know the road, know, you know, when it's time for me to drop, you know, uh, hire a driver, I know what my driver is is going to be dealing with and everything but at the end of the day like you know if you if you ain't if you're not doing it that way and you just driving you just buying a truck and you got a driver and hey listen like that's fine but like don't you know talk down on me because like you know i'm not i'm you know you know i'm i guess you saying i'm wasting my time you know or i gotta obey the same rules and anything I gotta, uh, you know, like, you know, like, you know, basically, like, yo, you could be making so much money if you was in, if you was doing semis. It's like, okay, that's fine for you, but it's not fine for me. The main two reasons that I don't want to do semis is that one, I, I'm not good at taking tests. I failed the CDL test when when I was gonna drive the school bus. I failed the test when I was gonna. Uh, uh for the act 235 you know uh to to carry a gun for for the security jobs and stuff like that so that's one thing i'm I'm not good at taking tests uh you know so and, and then another thing i i'm just not comfortable driving big trucks you know like that's me you know i i know i know i'm a guy and like i'm seeing women just like killing it driving tractor trailers and all that so you know like the, that that don't make me that don't make me uh, less of a less of a man. Like that's fine. Like you know, like you know, she you know she wanted to, you know that that's great. I I love seeing women who's not afraid to like you know doing a man's job. You know that that just go to show you that women can do anything, and I appreciate that. But like that don't make me less of a less of a man. You know, like I'm fine being comfortable being in the box truck business. Like. I, I I'm I you know I ain't came here to be rich. I came here I came here to be happy and free. You know, like I told y'all before on my videos, like I should have been I should have been doing doing this. You know, I could have been driving track to trust when I was twenty one, but I fell back. I you know, I I was misled. I was kinda scared at one point and you know, t you know, 
it didn't cross my mind until 11 years later, you know? So life, like, life is like that, that you don't really know that this is what you was, you know, putting this earth to do until 10, 11 years later, but it is what it is. But like, you know, I'm just like, kind of like disappointed on like, you know, everybody just talking down on people in the box truck industry. Like, I don't get it. Like, you know, just because it worked for you is not going to work for me. Just like, you know, when like the popular people in the, uh, the popular, the, the popular, uh, trucking business people who are on Instagram with these packages, you know, like giving them the, the one down, like giving you all the information. They listen, man, like I don't have that type of money to be giving y'all because like, what if it still don't work? So I just wasted like two thousand, maybe five thousand dollars to to seek help from you when I could have just like just find it out the hard way. You know, and that's why I'm taking this business as is is like I'd rather do the research. I'd rather uh you know learn you know like learn from it myself than to like you know cause cause, cause at the end of the day I'm gonna have to do it anyway. You know, like, I, I, I'm going to have to do this anyway. I, I, I'm going to have to, like, figure it out one one way of, of another because just because you showing me on a video or you talking to me on the phone, it may be different when it comes to my situation because you don't live in the same city I am. So, you know, uh, I live in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. It's a lot of people that's in down south that came to Philadelphia and told and said that they would never come here ever again. So they ain't, you know, so uh I'd rather learn it learn this the hard way. And if that time comes, then I'm ready to like buy semis and hire because like I'm never gonna drive them. But if that time comes that I do, you know, uh you know, buy a semi and hire, you know, and hire a, a truck driver, then, you know, then that's cool. But I'm not, I'm not focused on that right now. I'm, I, this is a slow grind. I, you know, it's going to take me some time, but I'm willing to deal with it, you know, and that's all, you know, and as long as I'm happy and free, that's all that matters to me. So, you know, to all my people that's in the box shop industry, continue doing y'all. Don't let nobody, you know, you know, like hurt, you know, hurt, you know, like just, you know, just just annoy the negativity, man. You know, I know I, I should be annoying this, but you know, I just want to tell all my box shop family out there. I know I'm new. I may not got no subscribes, subscribes. You know, you know, I'm not popular right now, but. It is what it is, man. Like, you know, I'm 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 happy. I'm happy you're doing this and that's all that matters. Later.